This is a case of supine PCNL done for a 27 mm pelvic stone. The CT shows stone in the pelvis and some parenchyma is seen between the calluses indicating possible long infundibuli. Sinus fat can be seen around the calluses and infundibuli indicating a non-dilated system. As expected, RGP showed non-dilated PCS with long narrow infundibuli with acute fill angle between the infundibuli and a filling defect seen in the pelvis indicating stone. Supine PCNL was advantageous. The puncture was done from the calyx end on and dilatation not done beyond the infundibulum pelvic junction and the also the dilatation size was limited to 16 French to avoid over dilatation and injury to the PCS. So stone fragments were spontaneously washed out with the irrigation fluid. Therefore stone migration chances are less in supine position and that too in this kind of a case in case the stones fragments migrate to the other calluses it would be difficult to negotiate the, to the other calluses because of the angle and because of the length of the infundibuli. Therefore in such a situation supine PCNL helps to avoid stone migration and even if it migrates we have retrograde access to access the inaccessible calluses. Thank you.